Hello friends, in this video we are going to learn about the React Native software requirements. Before this, you can't do any kind of development because this issue resolves first, okay? So, uh, what I face the issues, I'm explaining it, right? So, software requirements like Android Studio video is already prepared and uh, listed in the YouTube. You can go and check out, right? Node.js, uh, you can install the Node.js and NPM. After this, you need to install NPM G Global React Native CLI, right? After this, you need to open this file, sudo nano file. Okay, let me open this. So here you need to define Android home path and path to the platform tools to build to build the React Native app. So this is very, very important. If you're not going to do this, then again, you are skipping something and your project will not run, right? So this is very important. Next, uh, I found it like, um, then you have to install the uh, sudo app, get installed auto, de auto tools dev. Right. So these are the necessary points that you need to fix it and uh, <coughs> local properties for uh, take like um, whenever you build a project that uh, you are facing the issue that is uh, like, um, give me a second. Mm, I have mentioned that one as like uh, this one, like the local properties, local properties at the file. So for this, uh, I have already mentioned. So you need to create a local dot properties file. And here you need to define, uh, let me go to my uh, HTML folder. You can uh, choose any of my folder. In Android, you need to create a local.properties file. And here you need to mention the directory path. Home, Brajnikanth, Android, and SDK. Then you are successfully able to build the app, right? Again, if, you're fish, uh, if you are finding any kind of issues, then again, you can let me know in the comment box. Thank you so much for watching this video. Have a great day.